This is syllabus statement 253 on the Edexcel biology course. And here we're explaining how water is absorbed by uh, the root hair cells. So if we take a, a simple image of the plant, stem with a few leaves on here, and of course the root structure in the soil beneath the ground and one of the features that we see straight away in a root structure is the branching pattern and this is increasing the surface area for the absorption of water the roots will branch out and try and find a water source like this. If we zoom in on this structure and look at one of the smallest ends of the roots, then there appear to be hairs emerging from the surface like this. These are the so-called root oops root root hairs and microscopic examination reveals that these are epidermal cells cells on the surface of the root where the cell wall has been extended outwards like this this is the cellular cell wall would be a nucleus no doubt and a vacuole but this is the structure known as the root hair. So this is an extension of the cell wall and it increases the surface area for the absorption of water. So we've got surface area increases at two different levels. Over here is the branching root pattern and over here there's the extension of the cell wall at the cellular level rather than at the tissue level back here. If we examine microscopic image of root hair cells you can see the clear root hair structure here and down here on the epidermal cells of the root and this again further illustrates the surface area concept for the absorption of water. Now the mechanism by which plants absorb water involves first of all the active transport you'll recall that means the movement against the concentration gradient and involving energy of minerals so the plant actively concentrates the minerals in this area here and and of and of course inside here and this encourages the plant then to take up water by osmosis now you'll recall that in osmosis the water moves from the dilute region to the concentrated region that's the movement of water so the dilute region course is the soil water surrounding the root hairs like this and the concentrated region is created by building up the minerals inside these cells here and that's achieved by active transport so this is a two-part process active transport of minerals and the osmosis of water water then moves across the cortex of the root to the xylem which are on the inside here again by osmosis